Welcome to Eagle Education. This is Shekhar Metla, Software Trainer. Today's topic, String Introduction in Python. What is strings? Why we require to use in Python language? We'll see more details in this video session. Watch it. In this session, we are going to string introduction. We will see one by one. The strings is basics we will see in this session. Like uh, I am declaring a string like a course. And the course is in a double quotes and single quotes, you can use it. Python for beginners. Python for beginners. The simply a simple keyword I have written here. And uh, I'm taking as an print. It will be shows simple string declaration. Uh, C U V or yes. Yeah. Now execute this line of the code. See now the output is Python for beginners. The compiler output is showing Python for beginners right here. And uh, when trying to expanding the particular value over here to understand. Python for beginners. All right. Now my question is that Python, it's a Python for beginners. We have written in between, uh, if any, like uh, a first V S, where I am using here is in a single code, and uh, if I am using in between the single quotes of uh, first V S, like a single quote is ending here. And Python will not understanding what is this. Now see the Python first of is it's in a syntax error, it's showing throwing the error. Have you seen? For the purpose, there is a beautification of a Python language. We have a facility to use either single quote or double quote statement in the Python language as an declaration of a string. If you are using double quotes, it will be satisfies the Python and uh, the Python will be treated as an it's a completely a common string. It will be and it will be read and it will be prints with the Python's for beginners. All right. See now Python's course. You can add anything. You can add anything over here and it will be treated as a print. And the same thing will be written here. Either single quotes or double quotes, you can use it. Yeah, because Python may treat that if it is using single quotes, it will be terminated over here only. Rest of the things it won't be understanding. All right. Now the Python course is for beginners. If I have an a, a double quotes or uh, information, I require like uh, the Python. We have seen the single quotes, and uh, my question is that my Python. Beginners, the beginners only I require to print is then the double quotes. See. For this is the purpose you have to put it as a single quotes over there here to write like a first one and second last one. Now see here it will be treated as in a complete a common string with the double quotes. In the single quotes it can use the as it is in a string. Now take in a print. Get, go over there. Yeah. Python course for beginners within the double course it's showing. All right. This is the way a very basic strings you can declare using the Python language. And if you are having multiple lines for the string, time being here, it is in multiple lines. What it will go to that? Three things you take it here and enter and type what you want to know. What you want to print over there and three things at the end single quote three types and uh, here is my course details all right and likewise you can type anything multiple lines like you are drafting a mail you are sending multiple lines and you can use this uh, three quotes now you will take a printout of this. It will be prints like uh, this is the matter Python course for beginners. Here's the name, blah, 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 blah. See the output. 
that is very much pretty easy. What you are going to be giving within the string, like a three, three triple quotes, single quotes, what you are going to write in here, you will get as an output by reading the interpreter over here. Likewise, if you are appending any messages at all, like uh, email drafting, a dynamic content, you want to send like multiple lines, you use like this three uh, quotes of a uh, single and uh, write at the, at the starting level and ending level. And you will get an uh, what you're inside within that string, and you will get an output of uh, that particular string. All right, this is the way. It's a very simple to declare a string declaration using Python language. Thank you. Thanks for watching this session. Please do like, share, subscribe, and comment. For more information regarding these sessions, see the description below. Of my contact details are there. Thank you.